Good evening guys and welcome back to my channel. Now I had no intention of vlogging today. Um, this is the last week of school so this is a very busy week for me. Um, I am going to be vlogging but I don't know if this vlog is going to come out this week or next week because I have so much filming to do this week. This is the last week I have for seven weeks just me so i'm going to try and box out as much sit down videos and as much alone footage as i can now as you guys know we're going to be going on holiday next month and the sales are on now so i thought i would see if i could get some last minute holiday bits for me and my daughter now i will try and get some footage in matalan asda and primark um but if not i'll sit down and do a haul as soon as i get back home so yeah let's go I am back in the car. I'm sweating. Oh no. It went from 14 to 20 real quick. Oh. But I'm having an amazing day so far. I've just got up to Lakeside Lakeside, like the Into Mall, and I'm literally just looking for somewhere to park. Um, the sales have been going crazy. I have about three hauls for you guys. See what Primark saying. I'm hoping that they have a really good deal because, yeah, your girl needs to save a pretty coin. Um, I was supposed to be buying uniform today, but I just I, uh, too much has been going on. Too much has been going on. Guys, so I am home. <sighs> This week, I don't even have time to sit down. I have to just keep going. As I say, guys, I'm really trying hard to be consistent. So I'm about to sit down and film a Primark haul. As you can see, all the stuff is there. Don't watch my little kind of makeshift set up. We do what we can until we can do better. Um, I'm probably going to film the Matalan and Asda haul tomorrow because look how much stuff I've got in Matalan. Like, I wasn't even planning on getting so much, but the sales... Like, I'll just show you one thing because I'm not just supposed to be showing you guys yet. Now, I have, like, actual single duvet covers for my sofa because <laughs> me and my daughter... We like to get comfortable. So I have her old, she's got a king size bed now, but she used to have um, a single bed and I had two duvets. So what we do is we use her old blankets here when we're just having a movie day or we just want to chill. So I saw this really cute, um, it's called, what is it called? Bouse, bou, bouse call? It's kind of like teddy bear, um, duvet set. And I just thought, do you know what? It was... What was it originally? Guess how much I paid for this? Three pounds. So I bought two packets because I was like, this will go great over my single bed sheets. And with autumn fastly approaching, you know you're going to need that extra bit of warmth. So I was like, for three pounds, sold, sold and sold. I'm not going to give anything else away because <laughs> I had no business spending money today other than what I needed to get. And I did. So, yeah, I'm on lockdown. <laughs> um... Primark, I really try to give you guys the benefit of the doubt, but I just, we're not connecting anymore. Um, I've got myself three jumpers, but now I'm sitting here, I'm like, I don't think I'm going to keep them. I think I'm going to return them because they're nice, but I don't love them. And the one that I do like is £17. I just, I don't, it looks really pretty, but for £17, when it gets on me, it needs to feel really pretty and it just doesn't. So I don't know if I'm going to keep it. Good morning guys, it's Wednesday the 19th, I have just come back from school run, this is what I mean, This. <laughs> if you see me in the morning you wouldn't recognise me because it ain't about looking cute, it's about dragging on some practical clothes, I'm wearing this outcast boohoo top, Matalan flared trousers and flip flops. So I have a busy day ahead of me, I don't know where I was on the vlog but I have filmed how many videos have I filmed? I filmed about three videos and I have about three more to do. Just because this is the last, today and tomorrow is the last day I have with just me. And tomorrow or today, I want to take myself to the cinema and do something for me because <laughs> for the next seven weeks, it's going to be all about my daughter. Guys, it's like night and day. I am dressed. Uh, Makes a change from the school run outfit. I do have loads of clothes. It's just when I'm in a hurry, I tend to just chuck on whatever I know is already going to look good because it just speeds up the time. Where am I so fuzzy? So uh, I thought 
thought, do you know what? Because I'm wearing all white and I want to get like my dress messy because I'm not good with white. So I thought, oh, let me put a straw in the little red ball. The whole thing fizzled. It's all over my car. My white dress. Can you see that stain right now? My, my stomach as well. So I'm literally going home to put this in it. Oh, my Let me do it gently. One second. Oh, I'm so annoyed. Do you know when like, I'm already behind schedule by an hour and a half? But uh, I'm rushing home. Luckily, I have um, a dress in my laundry room ready to go. I just... All I'm literally going to do is go home, take this off, put the other dress on. So that was a quick outfit change. I'm just going to quickly go and do a return up Lakeside. And then I'm going to pop to Poundland and Home Bargains and start buying up our toiletries. What I'm wearing today. Nah, well, I thought I gained weight. <laughs> but the dress is looking better, so I don't know if I've gained or lost, but it looks cute. And because my heel back has started to come tough, on with the Primark white trainers. Hello guys. Now I don't even know what day of the vlog this is, so we're just gonna keep it rolling. So today is Wednesday. It's the first week of the holidays. We haven't really done shit. I'm gonna be completely honest. Like the weather's just been like meh, and like all the stuff that my daughter likes to do is like more outdoorsy or warm weathery. So I've just been real low key. Um, as you guys know, we're going away in a few weeks, as well as it's my birthday, as well as it's my daughter's birthday. So August is always a very expensive month for me. But I thought to myself, do you know what? I'm not going to force myself to do anything before the holiday. Because right now we're trying to save every little coin for the little, you know, excursions and little bits and trims. Do you want to say hi? Hi. Hello. Hello. A Y. A Y. A Y. And AJ, why are you getting shy on the camera? As soon as it, okay, that's her way of saying she doesn't want to be on camera. Okay, I've got lip gloss on, so I can't kiss it. It's fine. Is anybody else feeling this cost of living? We're one week in, and I'm already three hundred pounds down. I haven't even done anything, and I'm three hundred pounds down. I thought, okay, I'll pop out, I'll get us some lunch. So I went to get a um, Savaloy of chips. Two Savaloys, a portion of chips, and two pieces of chicken was 16 quid. And I'm sitting there like, that can't be right. Like, I'm really, like, I'm not going to lie. Like, there is, we need to do, take a stand because this is ridiculous. Hello guys, um, today is Sunday and it's very grey, very rainy, very overcast, but I think this is a perfect day. Um, I'm doing some errands and then I need to go home and sage because for the longest time I haven't done a clearing and I need to do a clearing, like I, I need to do a clearing. So yeah, I'm going to do some errands, go home and then do a clearing because I have 101 things. I need to sort out. Weather this week is going to be rainy and I don't want to go somewhere like Legoland where we're in queues getting soaked or we're going to catch a cold because we have already caught a cold. I'm not going to have the camera on me for this section because I just wanted to show you what I got from Home Bargains because uh, I'm going to start packing. Is it me or has sunscreen and stuff gone up? Because I paid like £6.99 each for these which oh my gosh they used to be like three pound fifty but let me just show you what i got so the first thing i got is i love to have a shower gel specifically for like holiday so it's like my holiday scent and i came across these in home bargains it's the palmolive pure with organic coconut shower gel it's 100 percent plant-based and this smells divine they have it in a pomegranate flavor but this one just it just hit different so i bought a couple of them and they were 125 each i then bought myself a travel pillow because i always forget to buy myself one my daughter has one and we're always like fighting over who has it so i thought i would get this and this was 350 and it is so nice and soft it's memory foam as i said um i then bought i fell in love with this on my last holiday actually i've never been one to use like an oil but this bangs again 
fitness was 5 99 each. It's just the 6 SPF bronzing tanning oil. I just love the smell of this and I like the tan it gives you. As I say, it does have a little bit of an enhancer. But yeah, I love this just for myself. So I bought two. They're exactly the same, but for some reason they had different lids. So it is what it is. Um, next, I just got us two loofers for our holiday. Um, and then I've bought this. Now, I never normally buy aftercare, after sun care. I usually would just have like a Savlon. But um, I've been hearing great things about the aloe vera gel. So they were doing this this huge one for like £2.50. So I thought that is amazing. And then I saw this and this actually smells really nice. It's exactly the same, but it just has an insect repellent in it. And what I like about it is it doesn't smell like, you know, typical like mosquito mosquito repellent sprays it doesn't smell like that it smells actually really nice so i thought that would be great because you know how the mozzies are in the evening they just love to bite up your skin then i bought some body wipes now i've never seen these these were about a pound and they are really long they're the size of a towel and i just thought if i'm out if i'm on a boat ride or if i'm on a beach and it's just a bit too sandy i don't know if they're going to have a shower on the beach so i thought let me just bring some body wipes because i'm one of these people like i like being in the sand but when i'm out of the sand i like to be out of the sand i hate when sand is just following you on your feet your legs all of that so i just bought a packet of them I then bought some toothbrushes. Oh my gosh. I was thinking toothbrushes. I realised I have to replace this because I ended up taking out two. Yeah, I did buy a packet of toothbrush, but I need to buy some more because I used two of these already. But yeah, um, they were a pound. Um, again, like I just mentioned, guys, this I fell in love with like a couple years ago on holiday. And ever since then, it's like a must. I love Nivea Sun, the smell. So I bought this kid's one for my daughter in 50 because she got burnt a little bit last time. And then I just bought myself one in 30. I just I just bought it for the scent. I would normally not want to pay 6 99 but when it smells so good, it's like, just, I just have to. And then I bought some instant... I can't even talk. I bought some insect repellent. Um... I bought this last time and it was pretty good. I hate the smell of it, but, you know, it's repellent. That's what it's supposed to do. Um, and this is the kids. And I think this was £1 or pound fifty. And then I bought one just to go in my bag. Just a little kind of mosquito repellent pump spray. Just, just, just if we're in areas that are just have a lot so yeah I just thought I'd buy that and that was a pound and then I bought this because do you know what when we go on holiday my daughter's perfectly fine just kind of like floating in the water but I thought oh this would be fun to do because it's like hard hard back so I just bought this catching set I bought this in Matalan actually it was four pound fifty and I think that's really good and I remember this from like the 90s where you'd put your hand you've got the tennis ball and you try and catch it so I thought that would be a cool game to play in the water with her just just if she wants to play in the water um yeah and that was it I've just started packing for my holiday haven't really started with me I've just got the towel the bags I haven't even started but I'm packing my daughters and this is the thing when you buy up, buy up over throughout the year and then you start to pack it, you realise, shit, I've actually got a lot. So I've packed like cover ups. I've packed shorts. I've packed evening outfits. I've packed tops. I'm going to pack her swimming costumes. And I still have, I've got her shoes. I've put the shoes, the shoes. I've kind of like doubled them like that, like so it's like that so i've got the shoes i've got the games i've got the towel got some of the toiletries i've got this but i'm thinking i still have to put in here knickers pajamas and bras <laughs> i don't know how much i'm weighing but you know when you start to get scared and these are both large suitcases so i'm like shit but yeah i'm i hope i'm not overweight because as i say i like to have stuff um but yeah, it's just crazy. I had to, I actually bought a lot more and I had to condense it down to like, let's be real canned. What are we going to wear? What do we really need? Because it's just a lot. You know, when you haven't packed in a while and you just forget how much shit you need to bring. Stress. <laughs> I have got so much still to pack, like my pajamas, my knickers, my bras, my makeup. Um, I'm not really bringing a lot of makeup, so that's not, I'm not tripping on that. I think I'm going to go and buy, you know, that viral suitcase that everyone was taking on holiday. 
that you can fit like loads of stuff in. I think I'm going to carry one of them and carry some clothes in it because I do not want to be overweight and tooey. I think it used to be 23, but I think it's 21 kg. <sighs> you know, the stress. I ain't going to get go through everything, but I've got some shoes. I've got some bags. I've got my costumes. I've got some evening wears. I've got some cover-ups. Um, what else have I got? Towel, body wipes, toiletries and I still got more shit to bring and it's just do you know when you just forget how much like how it is to pack your life in a suitcase and also I forgot how much I had and also guys oh my gosh I bought these on my holiday but then I was like mm, maybe I don't know but I've been rocking these don't watch my nails outgrown I need to get them done waiting for a week before my holiday but anyways bought these shoes from Primark and they're so comfortable and so nice. The only negative is when you're near water, it's slippery. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't like have this at the beach just because I don't think it would grip my foot. But just to walk around the um, hotel room and stuff. But what I might do is I might wear this. I don't know. They're just so cute. They're five pounds, but they're just so comfy and they're just so like effortless, you know. Hey guys, I am the worst at closing off vlogs, so I'm just here to say goodbye. Um, I want to say keep your eyes peeled if you're interested in my hauls because I have a come to Matalan with me coming up next. Um, I'm going to be vlogging over this summer holidays, but I'm going to be doing it every fortnightly rather than weekly just because... I don't want to put myself under pressure. Like, this summer is really about me and my daughter. And obviously, with going away and stuff, I don't want to do it exactly, um, not real time, but I kind of want to give myself a bit of distance and space because, obviously, like, I'm going away. I don't want people to know my business like that. But, um, yeah, just keep a lookout because we're going to have some fun videos ahead. And I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.